Hey guys, here's another step for the movie poster series. So now that we've employed destructive elements or false structure into this building, we want to incorporate the building so it looks like it really blends in with it, specifically with colors. So the first thing we're going to do is create a little bit of a rusted effect on the building itself. And what the way we're going to do that is the burn tool. The burn tool is really effective for creating dark shadows and in this case with the building it'll create a very it'll create a wonderful rusted old type look effect it'll also create a type of burn effect but we don't want to use this brush we want to use something that would be a little better so we're gonna go with spatter and 24 pixels is fine midtones as far as the range goes we want to focus on midtones and we'll make the exposure 75 percent so make sure that your city layer is selected and just start coloring it in and it's very subtle at least at first but the more you do it the more you'll start to see it and if you go layer over layer then you start to really notice the difference try and be as chaotic as possible about it and usually a stylus pen tool is the best way to go so we've got that now let's make the brush bigger and cover the rest of the building. Really give it that old, nasty effect. Go ahead and go other over other layers because you're gonna be playing with those layers layer anyways. Or if you don't, then make sure that this building is a separate layer, as we talked about before. Just really color it in. Color it in everywhere. There, now it looks old and dilapidated. So we went from this to this, much better effect. And when we get it behind our background and our poster, it's gonna really fit in. It's gonna fit in really, really well. So the next thing we wanna do is start to remove windows because no exploded building would be complete without exploded windows. Very easy and simple task, but we're gonna go through it anyways. 